Deputy Prime Minister Dato Sri Dr Wan Aziza Wan Ismail has called on women to go for cervical cancer screening following a pilot program launched to combat the disease in Malaysia. She said this as the disease is the third most common cancer among women in Malaysia after breast cancer and colorectal cancer. According to Dato Sri Dr. Wan Aziza, who is also the Women, Family and Community Development Minister, cervical screening fell far below the World Health Organization's WHO target of 70 percent. Ini ada satu yang mudah, yang sepatutnya tiap wanita lebih pada 30 tahun memberikan buat screening ini. Dan saya mensyorkanlah kalau boleh kita pergi dan membuatkan satu test ini yang mudah dan memberikan kita kesan yang baik. She said this to reporters after launching ROSE, or removing obstacles to cervical screening, in Kuala Lumpur today. ROSE is an innovation by University Malaya, UM, and VCS Foundation of Australia. A memorandum of understanding between the two organizations was also inked at the event to establish a not-for-profit joint venture to combine their expertise to enable the implementation of ROSE. The um, LPPKN clinics are going to start offering um, the HPV test very soon, but I can't speak on, the, on their behalf to see where, where this can be rolled out. But that's from the governmental side. In the public side, what we hope to do is that uh, we will run some community engagement programs, and uh, of course that will depend on our corporate partners. Malaysia's National Immunization Program for Human Papilloma Virus, or HPV, has achieved vaccination coverage of over 90 percent among 13-year-old girls, protecting them against the main types of HPV that cause cervical cancer. Also present at the event were Health Minister Dr. Sri Dr. Zulkefli Ahmad and Deputy Women, Family and Community Development Minister Hannah Yeo.